Hi, y'all. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, I'm cutting up a bunch of cherry logs here I got. I seldom get to work with stuff this straight, but when I do, I, I enjoy it. Uh, I wish I had more of this kind of stuff. And I love working up cherry. It's probably my favorite. But I started off with my 592, running a 24-inch barn chain. And uh, I, I'm loving this saw. I haven't had it long. I get into some bigger wood sometimes, not this stuff, but uh, some pretty big stuff I get that my buddy Pumpkin brings me. He's a tree cutter around here. And uh, I've needed a bigger saw, it's smaller saws. It was just any of y'all that, that run them, you know. Uh, so I broke down and, and bought this 592. And man, it's a screamer. It sounds like a dirt bike running. And uh, I know people say that it, they're loud, and it, it is loud. But it doesn't bother me. I'm always got a uh, earbuds in, got to be listening to music, whatever I'm doing. So, so that doesn't bother me at all. And it's a little heavy, but it's not like I'm wagging it through the trees and woods and you know, on my knees cutting and stuff. So it's really not bad, especially the way I stage these logs like this. And uh, I run a tank of gas out of it, and then I cranked up my 572. I run a 20-inch barn chain on it, and, and man, I love it. When, once I picked that 572 up, it feels like a just like a baby saw or something almost after running that 592, but uh, I love them both. Right now, I wouldn't, it'd be hard for me to pick one over the other. I cut up a pile of uh, pecan after this with the 572, and uh, I don't ever really time myself, but I look back at these videos and, and see kind of how long it takes me, and and man, I, there's just nothing like having the right tool for the job because uh, the 592 hit, eat up these cherry logs, and the 572 did the same with the pecan. It wasn't, it wasn't a very big pile at all, and it was smaller stuff, uh, nothing big. To, I, when I started cutting firewood, I was using a little steel uh, MS250. I think it's a 50cc saw, and they're great saws, man. We use several of them at work, but for this kind of cutting. Uh, cutting firewood, trying to get a lot done in a little bit of time. It's nothing like having a, a powerful saw, a pro saw, and uh, I've really come to see that. I love these Husqvarna saws. It was hard for me to break down and give the money for them, but I'd buy them all over again now. And uh, it gives me some of my time back that I can do more important stuff with, you know. I enjoy running a saw, but there's uh, i got to keep things in perspective, you know, and, get back to my family and stuff when I can. So this allows me to get some things done quickly. Thank you all again for watching. I, I really appreciate that and uh, starting to get some comments and stuff. And I appreciate y'all, I really do. And Mama Fox has got three pups out there with her right now. She come out here to see what I was cutting on, I guess. They have several dens over here around my wood yard. And they're using that's the active den they got right now is right over there in that little creek bank. And they have uh, one den right by a pile of wood that I use. I hear the little pups barking every now and then. Back 40, he's got them deer that come around. I got foxes that come around my place. She had five pups year before last. And this year and last year, I'm... I'm I know she had three last year, and I'm only seeing three this year. 